translation. When the irreligion is prominent in the family, O Krishna, the women of the family become corrupt, and from the degradation of womanhood, O descendant of Vrishni, comes unwanted progeny. This is very important point. <coughs> For good population, uh, without good population, uh, in the society, gentlemen, culture, educated, following the rules and regulation of religious principle, how we can expect peace and prosperity? That is not possible. <coughs> so the whole Vedic system was meant for having very good population. Not such kind of population uh, who are addicted to killing and drinking and so many other sinful activities. No, then you cannot check. If such population is there, then everything will be polluted, especially nowadays because uh, there is one top good population and they go and the government uh, and how you can expect good government, good administration, uh, the whole population is polluted. Therefore, in such a great state, USA, the president is being uh, tried and is being criticized. Uh, oh, there must be good population. Uh, so to have good population, the omen should be very chaste. Uh, that is the basic principle of Vedic civilization. And to keep the omen chaste, uh, it was the function of the responsible father or in the absence of father, the elder brother, he must get the woman, the girl, married. It is compulsory. There is no compulsory for man to marry because a man may remain brahmachari. Uh, by training he can abstain from sex. But if woman is not protected very strictly, it is very difficult. Hmm. It is very difficult. Uh, 